Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today it's going to be actually a really interesting video, so stick along to the end guys. It's not going to be too much of a long video, but I've got some interesting news to hear. This is episode 84 with me, cool guy, and you, the awesome viewers. By the way, I said I have some interesting news to hear, and I meant to say I have some interesting news to say. Never mind. Um, okay then, so... Let's, let's just get straight off and talk about my King of the Ring and how much I failed at it and got quarter bumped by a dickhead and I'm very angry. The dude wasn't a dickhead, he was actually a very nice guy. Well, I don't know if he was a nice guy or not, actually, because we didn't even talk in the chat. Um, but yeah, I got an elite card. I will show you who I got. I was actually happy with who I got because I don't think I had him in the catalog before and that is none other than... I know I already had Jimmy so I mean what I meant is now I can pro Jimmy so that's what I meant to say. So let's go and pro Mr. Jimmy Uso and he is now a pro. Perfect. So let's go let's go show you the catalog. Okay guys, let's get into the actually interesting part of this news, which is my team situation. Okay? Now the last team event, we did not get the ultimate card, which was the Finn Balor. And then it, it was, yeah, it was it wasn't really important to me. But I am officially leaving Burrito Beasts. It has been amazing. I'm gonna shout out everybody in this team one last time. What awesome people, Rainbow! What a team you made. Uh, props to you, dude. And it's gonna be it's gonna be sad times. I uh, I will be actually sad about leaving this team. So big shout out to Robe, Rainbow Warrior. Abdullah, C C M eight, GTA, Jerry, John, Britton, Metavolution, what a grinder this guy is, and Vanit. Big shout out to all you guys, and here we go. We're gonna leave the team right now. Yes, I'm sure. There we go. I'm out, I'm out. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna agree a team. And I have no idea what I wanna call it. So I think, I think, Supercard of Fame, Supercard Hall of Fame, okay. I like it. I like it very much. I like that very much. Oh, sweet. Okay, let's get let's get something nice here. I do like that one. Oh, brilliant. Can change everything about this. I think that that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. I'm gonna leave it to that one, but I think I can. I want to change this to maybe a car like that, and then, and then I think that one is the nicest. But I think I think we'll go with. I think we'll go with that. Okay, so it changes. Um, it's gonna be unfortunately ultimate. I will from time to time. For like, uh, like, well, what we'll do is I will make it so anybody can join sometimes, okay? And what we'll do is we'll like, I will. No, okay. What I'm gonna do is there's gonna be one spot in this team that I will keep free, okay? That person, if you win, I'm gonna be doing like these little giveaways, okay? And the winner of the giveaway gets the shot to be in our team. And like, the goal is obviously that. You're in SummerSlam tier or Harden tier, and Ultimates would really help out your deck. So, if you guys are interested, and if you're not in Ultimate++ Plus Plus or anywhere near Ultimate tier, and you guys are really struggling to get better cards, I mean, if you're in Elite Plus, and almost in the verge of Elite Plus Plus, and, I mean, yeah, you can, but maybe leave it for people who are a little bit lower down. I mean, you can join you guys, definitely, but... I would, I would I would opt more for people who are, like, really low, like WrestleMania, SummerSlam. So, if you guys want to join... Um, I think on a on a weekly basis, I will I will do some kind of thing on my streams where we we, we pick someone or we'll do like a random uh, number generator. Whoever guesses the number or something gets to be in the team, something like that. But for now, for now we'll do that, um, and then we'll do 
I don't, well, I have to, pl I have to kind of plug myself, don't I? Call me on YouTube. Alright, guys. Supercard Hall of Fame. Well, you guys might like this name, you guys might not like this name. I personally think it was pretty cool, Supercard Hall of Fame. Um, I'm gonna go with this name. Look, if it is what it is, I'm not a very, I'm not a very imaginative, uh, imaginative person. I am sometimes. I mean, but sometimes like coming out to concrete thinking and just like, what's a really cool? I mean, come on, I came up with cool. I mean, as I said, I always love this name. It came, like the way I got the name is very fun to me and all of that. But you know, obviously, lots of people don't really like the name cool. I mean, it obviously does ring quite childish and stuff. But it is what it is. So. Uh, let me just make sure no really no spelling mistakes. Super card, car, card, H O F Hall of Fame. Okay, cool. Got me on YouTube. Perfect. Uh, open tour. No uh, invite only. Boom. It is created. Okay, so um, yeah, join the team, guys. Join my bloody team, uh, and I'm excited. So yeah, that is the interesting news I've got for you today, guys. I'm gonna start the grind on RTG. Oh well, wait, no, I'm not, because I've got more interesting news. Who saw that coming? Well, I did because I knew about it, but you didn't. So here's my interesting, my 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 second more interesting news. Well. So it depends what you, how you guys think if it's more interesting or not. But anyway, I am officially starting my 24-hour challenge. <gasps> What's that, cool guy? Basically, I need to finish my RTG in 24 hours. Simple, simple. I need to finish RTG in 24 hours. That's it. If I don't, horrible forfeit. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I did, I like well, the video. The video like apart now. I do have a bit of bad news. It doesn't. It doesn't affect you guys. Obviously, it affects me and my life. Um, it's quite bad news. But I think on the on the all, on, on the whole, um, I, I knew it was coming. So you know, uh, team. That's awesome. I'm excited for that. Let's try and you know stream this and get this RTG done. But let me just put the video aside now and talk to you guys. Um, you know, on, on a more serious note. So, um, I got my results for my exam this morning. Uh, I would literally just woke up and I called my mum. Uh, she was out shopping and uh, she, she said she had some bad news for me. And uh, we agreed that we'd wait and open the letter together. But she had got an email f and then she opened it. And basically, well, I failed my exam. It was my English exam. Um, you know, essays like reading text, analysing those texts. I'm dyslexic, which is one. That's something actually you guys might not know about me, but I am a dyslexic fuck. Um, like, really goddamn dyslexic. <laughs> um, but yeah, I am. I'm not using it as an excuse. But anyway, like, seriously, if anybody out there, anybody of you guys have exams coming up, have taken exams, waiting for results, or, or have failed exams or have passed exams you guys know the stress how it is and and what it all what it all means but for people who are going to be taking exams soon or are waiting for results or just people who haven't yet done that in their life but are going to just you if you fail there if you fail and you think you haven't done your best then you have failed if you failed but you know in your heart of hearts that you did the best you can you did not fail Okay, on paper you failed, but you didn't actually fail. So that's my bit of sad news. I mean, more sad for me, isn't it, really? But look, my dream is YouTube, guys. Uh, this is what I really want to do for the rest of my life. And I, I think with your guys' help and your guys' awesome support, which is what you guys have been giving me over the last couple of months, I think. Honestly, I think I maybe maybe I've got a shot at this. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm still, still, it's still early days, but who knows? But yeah. I did fail my exam, it's going to be very hard telling, telling the dad, telling, telling, telling other people, telling my old, you know, teachers at school that they're alright by me the whole goddamn time and I'm such an idiot. But yeah guys, it's life, move on, and uh, just, yeah. I, I, I did my best, I mean, yeah, I, I studied, I, did, I didn't study a lot, you know, I didn't, 
But the last two weeks, I gave everything I had at the exam. I gave every tiny bit, ounce of concentration. And, and I, did, I really did all... Yeah, I could have studied more at home. And I could have done... I could. Have, you can always do more. But I think I think I'd, I think I'd, I'd, I'd try my best. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I'm sorry to dampen the mood with the Bill Sad News. But look, it doesn't affect you guys. Don't feel too sorry for me. Um, honestly, it's okay. I will, I will, I'm going to retake them for June, I think, or maybe I'm not even going to, you know, maybe I'm just going to live under a bridge, who knows, peace out guys.